Hello, in this uh, AWS Restart program, I wish to demonstrate about this uh, lab number 225 uh, that is introduction to Linux. Okay, let me quickly uh, restart this lab. So, here in this lab, we will be understanding about how we can uh, connect it to this lab, especially in the Linux environment. So, you need to wait till the lab is getting ready. First is uh, you need to start the lab. So, once you complete your exercise, you can do this end lab. So, this as long as the sand watch is running, we need to bus, uh, we need to wait uh, till the lab is getting ready. Okay. So, this lab is approximately 30 minutes. So, just go through this objectives of this lab. So, the objectives of this lab is after completion, you will use this SSH to access this Amazon uh, Linux AMI with the Vokram labs, understand the purpose of this man command and also demonstrate the search features of this man pages as well as examine the man headers. So, these are all the things which will be helpful. As the most important thing is that how to connect with SSH uh, to the Linux server. Okay. So, let us wait till the lab is getting ready. Okay. Now, the lab is ready. It took about 2 to 3 minutes of time to get the lab uh, uh, ready. Please remember this uh, exercise you need to do more or less uh, to get the system environment ready for almost all the Linux labs. So, the first uh, the steps which we want to do the task one use SSH to connect Amazon EC2 instance. So, here what you need to do is that if you want to explore you can even explore Amazon AWS by clicking this a new window will open. So, you will see a new uh, I mean uh, a Linux instance has been created, but for us what we can do you can just say show uh, once you click the details you can just show uh, you please download this uh, ppk file ppk is a public private key which you need to download ok. So, this is the lab user 6 dot ppk and also just note down this uh, public key a uh, public IP public IP which is there. So, I just open this notepad and then copy paste this particular one ok. So, this is done please note down and also I have downloaded this key file. So, if you want putty you can download uh, from this particular location download it here. So, you get even putty also downloaded. So, now let us do this lab uh, how to connect to this AWS Linux server. So, here once you open this console you can also explore this EC2 I mean service. So, once you see this EC2 service, there is one instance which is running. You can see this, this is the Linux server, this one command host. So, you can also check that this is your public IP and the server is T3 micro with Linux. Okay. The one way you can connect to this server for this Amazon Linux is that you can also connect through this EC2, uh, I mean connect to the instance, EC2 instance connect. So, here also you can get a way where you can access uh, this uh, EC2 connection, but in this particular uh, session he has disabled. Okay. So, now I will show you okay. since you have downloaded this putty uh, double click this putty run run and in, in place of host name you can just paste this IP address. Okay, this is the first step in connections please give something like maybe 15 or 20 or 30 minutes this is for timeout okay. and in SSH just double click SSH until you see this auth and this credentials yes please browse this I mean uh, this uh, PPK key which you have downloaded just a minute back click that and say open. So, you see this one once a dialog box open please provide accept and the default username which you need always to connect for AWS is EC2 hyphen user only press that. So, yes you are connected you are connected this dollar prompt indicates that 
you have connected to the bash i mean bash login you have uh, you have connected to this linux server so this is the first task which has been detailed in the steps and as we have already logged in with ec2 hyphen user yes you can see this particular one and uh, if you are using a mac system or if you are using the other steps are provided here and linux users the steps are provided so now let me explore this task number 2 explore linux man pages see this is we are in uh, point number 24 please practice up to point number 24 multiple times because all the other exercise requires the same procedure for logging in so here he asked us to do this man man so what i can do i just show here the screen man man is manual so this is task number two type man and man manual of manual so you see here the instructions basically the name synopsis descriptions and overview examples files options and see also is applicable you see at the top name is man and interactive interface to the online reference manuals synopsis i mean this description if you press space bar you can see the second page like that third page fourth page fifth page like this at any point of time if you want to say uh, uh, q for quit q for quit once again i show you q press q so here i can press space bar okay don't press control c okay like if i want to go back previous p for previous you can see like this pages more pages which are there so we are 15 percent 18 percent 21 percent it is the display of the status is shown at the status bar q for quit q for quit this is how we need to read the manual of manual okay so this is uh, the first lab i think we have completed this lab uh, we will again meet in the next lab thank you and bye